of that. Rambo style. <laughs> T-Mobile means business. You said you've never seen him with a bandana on before. I, I can't recall ever seeing him in his I, career wearing a bandana. Do you know what? As they say in the fashion business, he works it well. He does, in fairness to him. He yeah. wears it well. He's working the bandana look very well indeed. T-Mobile, the 37-year-old, <laughs> against a 14-year-old. How about that? So if, if he was twice his age, he'd only be 28. <laughs> He's two and a half times his age. I'll let you tell Timo that later. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> he has been top of the pile, ranked number one, now ranked number eight at the moment. 12 singles titles on the world tour. The uh, left-hander, of course, Olympic team silver and team bronze. Uh, coming perhaps towards the, uh, the sunset of his career. The sun is rising for Tomo Kazu Harimoto, ranked 39, but that, I am sure, will rise. Youngest ever world champion started playing at two. Uh, amazing. He had his birthday here uh, uh, just before, a day or so before the first round. So, uh, <laughs> Kylo Hizami, he's down with kid, isn't he? <laughs> Not quite sure what that meant, but you know. From <laughs> he's a very strict referee as well. Don't mess with him. So here we go, this should be a fascinating contest. Looking forward to this. First blood to the old boy. Perhaps he's hiding some grey hairs, I don't know. Perhaps that's what the bad is on. <laughs> Not that I can talk, but. Good start from the German. Tim Mays, Hamato. A bit to do here. Just 12. <laughs> He's a prodigy, isn't he? Amazing. Just 10 days before his 13th birthday, so he uh, certainly it. looks comfortable at the top table. A little bit of uh, luck there for Karimoto with Timo trying to race that one down. Nearly got it as well. Oh. Made contact with the ball. What a forehand that was. Even move. The young man's re reactions. Aramoto couldn't get there in time. What a come, come back, a turn around. Just shows the composure he has. Backhand there from Timo, and the ball just bending away from the table. He creates a lot of spin, a lot of arc on the ball. Got it! Oh, what a fabulous combination from Haramoto. Forehand, backhand. Thank you very much, that will do. <laughs> Anything you can do? trapped very quickly in this game but he's certainly come charging back. Harimoto fully up for this match. These two have only met once before on the World Tour circuit and it was pretty recently. Timo coming out and stopping that one. No 4-1. Four 4-1. One. Four one. Timo just being a little bit more experienced in that match. Yeah, I think what Timo we worried about is the guy's a, a quick learner. Deceptive backhand spin up there from Timo. Looks like he was going to play cross four at the last second. Changed the angle, played down the line. Three years of experience, Tokyo Olympics. Could be phenomenal, couldn't it? Joy! Well, 
Well, he's already beaten teammates on the national team. He's beaten Jun Mitsutani and Kofi Niwa. Not bad results for a 14 year old. Got him! <laughs> How about that replacement? Goodness me. Come out like a train. His new nickname could be a Harry Motor Express after that. I like that. Quick, <laughs> quick trademark it. <laughs> Copyright that brand mark right there. It's going to be a sellout. Good. Wow. He started really slowly, but once he got going, there was no stopping him. Really impressive from the youngster. It's not. It's not often you see Timo Paul made to look lead footed, but he looks second best. That game wrapped up. Second game. Harimoto on 15th. Love. A bit more spin injected off the ball's racket there. Harimoto just not dealing with it. Great work though from Timo Ball. Managed to get everything back. Looking and just waiting for the mistake from the Japanese youngster. Not much you can do about that though. Wow. Cheeks from Timo Ball. He knows he's in a bit of a scrap here. Harry Mother just stamping down the ball a little bit too much there. Killing the speed a little bit. He needs to take care of the ball if he's playing cross court. Especially with the spin off ball's racket. Six points, very quick tower down. Within that 15 second window, of course. <laughs> That's brilliant table tennis from both of those <laughs> players. Nice little pirouette there from Timo, too. receive there. Might have looked like he was going to flick at the last second when he touched the ball. Look at his back from Timo Ball. Thought he had it all under control. Wasn't quite the case. Playing very quickly as well. Quite a few games in here. Got it! Was it again? Wasn't quite in the corner, but it was good enough and just swerved and spun away from Ball's outstretched hand. It's better from Timo there, linking the serve and his forehand in. No, Moto just trying to flat bat it, just trying to stay in the point. Important for Timo here to try to get his forehand in as much as possible. This is great table tennis. Don't take your eyes off that ball at all. Right. I was going to say it wasn't power, was it? Placement that time. Lovely little fade flick there, classic shot there from Harimoto. 
Oh, getting involved. A little bit of partisanship up there. Oh, <laughs> slither of the end of the table. A little finger raised. Acknowledgement and apology. From watching Harry Moto, who can be very positive, passionate as well, but it's nice to see Timo being a little bit vocal. He's usually definitely the quieter of the two. Left, seven, nine. Astonishing little serve, that isn't it? Chucked into the body, inside out. Johnny! Probably need our super slow mo just to work out what's going on, really. I don't think uh, Timo. Saw what was on that serve from our angle here. We could see he dropped the racket, played a little bit flatter on the ball. No spin serve was great to see. And there's another one. Oh, this time ball nails it to take two game points. Sometimes look, uh, I don't know, a club player. I mean, he was just left to the side of the court there, wasn't he? Save one game point. A bit more work to do, though. Oh, and poor Sarah will get ball across the line. No matter who you're supporting, it's always a bit of a shame to see that. Trademark reverse serve there from Bolo to wrap up that game. A <laughs> little smile. <laughs> He's chatting there to Michael May. He's going, good grief, this kid is good. Do you know who I am? <laughs> <laughs> thing is, he's so fresh-faced, Aramoto. They were practicing before this session got underway, and I was sitting with quality uh, and shot where the uh, and you can think player, they Tim JJ sit on the benches there. Sometimes and if it's a little bit high, you have to do split a little bit. A ball boy. That's the how first one, he is. it's already <laughs> late, and then you can move up. Give the ball Come back on. anyway. So rage Well, marvelous, marvelously, you could still qualify for the Team 2 Juniors, which is next door to us. But I, I think it would be polite just to, just to say <laughs> no. I, I think I'm all right, thanks. <laughs> I'll stick with the seniors for now. Uh, I'm okay. Yeah. We've got the T2 Juniors. We've got the uh, TTX form of the game, which is fun for everyone. Oh. We're having a party here. A table tennis party, you know. Start from ball. That was tentative from the German. One, two. I've seen it time and time again, though. Players playing against ball. He's very difficult to beat, no matter if he's playing well, if he's playing bad. He can drag you into the game, make you play an extra one or two shots every point. A, a legend like he is. And a, a long serving legend as well, without having something about you. Inside our forehand there from ball, gripping from behind the ball underneath the table. <laughs> I think that might have taken a touch of me. It flew across as well. Really fast shot from Haramoto, and he's back on level terms. <laughs> Lovely link up from serve to forehand attack there from Harimoto, giving himself a lot of space in the middle of the table. Yeah, the hand speed is astonishing. Good at the game. Fast and true into the body of Bolt, and that will uh, bring the uh, mistake from the best of you. And the ball is one of the best, of course. And it's a 
carbon copy. Three, six. A couple of points down at the beginning. And the storm pass ball. Being a little bit like the first game. They <laughs> took the net. Six, four. Sometimes the echo is so small to be imperceptible. On the edge of the, uh, the table as well. Lovely reaction there from the hands of both. Short, compact strokes, keeping the ball in play just enough to make get the mistake from Harimoto. really well they're playing into the backhand and then switching directly into the forehand of Harimoto. Well, he launched into the forehand but it was sent back by Harimoto. Yeah, there was balls in the end. Japanese yeah, just with his nose in front. Absolutely no fear on the backhand flick there. So powerful over the table. And no fear of his opponent either. Yeah. Like the thing. It's it's he doesn't beat anybody on this day, I think. See Bull flying in a, a chop, but there we go, pushed by Harry Moto to try something different. Seven, ten. Can you wrap this up? Still over nine minutes this game to go. That'll do it, thank you very much. Well, when he wins the game, he does it quickly. Four minutes and one second the first game, 4.43 the uh, third game, it's more of a battle the middle one that uh, ball got over the line, 11-9, about 6 minutes and 10. And he likes to get on with the game, doesn't he? He's bossing it, that's for sure. Now, this is where we're losing time in the game. This technically should be a 15 second changeover. 30 seconds on the clock. Not that I'm watching it too closely, of course. <laughs> Over hitting that one, Harimoto. Oh. Lovely forehand spin up there from Ball. Change of tactic there, throwing in the long Two service, up. catching the youngster off guard a little bit, and then. Time to play a forehand winner cross court. Okay. Oh, seesaw. And it seems to be the beginning of these games, no indication of how it's going to finish very often. One, four. Two thin edges in a row, one going for each player. Speed on that flick backhand. Backhand top from there from Timo. Yeah, fighting fire with fire. She as you can mix it up. Die! The 
left himself a bit open there. And Harimoto is quite happy to uh, apply the finishing touches. Lovely backhand trick there from Primo. Deep into the Harimoto backhand. Quickly, Aramoto <laughs> on his uh, coattails very quickly, actually. Aramoto clever on his block there, playing down on the ball, cutting off the spin, making it harder for Timo, having to create his own spin after that. Just didn't succeed in that one. Forehand in the body. Oh, keeping the advantage, but having to work really hard. Definitely get a, another one in. They yeah, are playing these at uh, breakneck speed. <laughs> he knew he should have made that one. Stomp of the feet there. Yeah, a bit too old. He's by his standards for a temper <laughs> But that's what it means. You've got to keep yourself focused, but you, you know, if you're frustrated, show it. Not a problem. Seven. This is a great match. <laughs> it really is. Oh, all his experience. Really having to fight hard against the young man. Not inconceivable. It might take a 3 1 lead here. You know, doing really well there after losing the last couple of points to maintain composure to go 9 8 up. Gave it everything there, wasn't worrying too much about the game situation, but yeah, the angle is all wrong. Credit to Timo though, reacting to that ball in his body. Well, can he pull this back to two games apiece? Yes, he can. He started well in that game, yeah. had to hold on. Uh, so uh, Aramoto came charging back at him, but he held on well. First point with so good quality to form mid. Now the point is the ball is coming up. Ah, one second, one second, good. Ah, fluctuated, doesn't it? This game, ah, two and four. Ah, the ball is coming up. 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 Will prevail in this match. He will take home the uh, the cash. More important for these guys who will get the extra game to go towards the grand final. Lovely forehand open up there from Timo. Coming out, trying to be aggressive, trying to attack. Love just rushing the forehand flick there. He knows time is ticking down. Oh. Lovely little uh, no spin spin up there from Timo. Yes, changing the pace. Oh, and it's uh -huh. a timeout there from Harry Moto. One minute. He's going with the situation he can to find himself in two or three down. And he's just flying it back. Sometimes a timeout can be used not just for tactics, just to break the rhythm of his, their opponent. Love three. So he responds 
two minutes and five seconds on the clock. Match is here, of course, 24 minutes. Three, one. The time mark we got him on the board in this fifth game. Those are top. Four, one. So maybe looking at the clock, thinking just a couple more points, and surely I can see this through. <laughs> it's a great shot from up above on the plane camera. You can just see the placement perfectly, and from here you'll probably see the power. Yes, look at that. Like a bit of a deflection. That's a good, even bigger deflection. A good serve though from Hayamoto, trying to change the play a little bit. Almost onto our <laughs> desk in front of us. Such was the depth. He was being forced back. And forced back. And there you go. That'll do the job. 40 seconds though. Two more to his time on this. Lovely side top spin serve. Harry Mother not reading it. And there's the game's up now, surely. Three points in 30 seconds. I doubt it. But he only has just over 10 Time seconds. Up. One minute. <laughs> oh, why are they old Michael Mays? You don't need the timeout, but you know what? For the time they put the clock back on again and they get to the table and they get ready, <laughs> that'll be that. Thank you very much. He's definitely read the room. Yes, play. he's playing the book. I don't think. Nothing to say, to you team. Just relax. Pal. We go. I think we wrap this up. This what are you doing tonight? <laughs> Fancy a beer somewhere? That's the team sport, but uh, come on. On you. Yeah, you've uh, won a thousand dollars. Thank you very much. Am I on ten percent, by the way? Oh, you <laughs> As your captain, of course. It's a shame for having my job because. Very quickly. I oh. <laughs> couldn't quite get there. It is a shame for having my He plays so well, and he was ahead to one. Um, but it's a good recovery from Timo Boll, who wins that last game that was timed out 6-5. It was tight at the end. Very nearly got that extra point in, but it wasn't to be. And so Timo Boll squeaks it 3-2. to two. <laughs> Yeah, enough. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, sure. This. And it uh, was close, wasn't it? Haramoto with more points and more forehand winners. But uh, Timo Boll won when it mattered. This just goes to show that you can't always rely on statistics. And uh, this is why, I mean, he faced a real battle here against Haramoto. He won't win the war going forward, I am sure. And of course, these guys are bound to meet each other as we go through to the second half of this T2 season. Said how a Japanese teenager is such a quick learner, such quick hands as well. Just some high quality highlights here showing the skill and depth of play of both of these players. Team are really having to dig deep throughout the match, though. That was a great view of that forehand <laughs> from Haramoto. Look at that. Yeah. Never knows when to give up, and he fought to the end, was ahead early on in the match. But in the end, the wisely old Timo Ball takes it by three games to two.